Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this power up. Oh, whilst the power gear is active. Yes. Ah, okay. Ah, Mega Man. I've made a break. Okay, Mega. What'll it be? Uh, should we get the thing that reduces knockback? Because that seemed amazing. Yeah. Or the speed gear booster, one of the two. This seems cooler. It also seems broken. It also seems slightly unfair. Let's do it. Yes, please. Energy waste makes it. That was the thing that puts you in like power mode literally the entire time. Wow. Okay. Yeah. We're not doing that. Are you sure? Okay. Do you think part of Doctor Light's problems is that he always seems to create robots who have like a gun on one of their arms? Yeah, probably. Or you know, built-in weapons. That that might be an issue with his design that he needs to think about the next time he makes a robot. I mean, you know, I guess it kind of means that Roll's safe. I mean, what is he going to do? Like, whack people with a broom? No, Roll has a gun for an arm, I think. What? Yeah, I mean, in Marvel vs. Capcom, she has a gun. And people think Dr. Light is the good guy? Uh, I know. Anyway, well, our next guy is Impact Matt. Who appears to have electrified barriers. I'm with Dr. Y on this one. Dr. Light must die! Oh, and he's got the powered up little robots to fire three shots instead of one. What are they called again? Metals. The metals, yes. Ah, these guys. The good old overhead, irritating projectile. The, the pickaxe ones. We've seen them before. Yeah, but in, it's what, just you know, Mega Man X. I think. The fact that there's all. It's just. Hey, thing. T, you know what we have now. Up, up, up. Uh, oh, sweet. Oh, yeah. wait a minute. So... If you d use the power gear and then use the shield... Exactly, and then immediately... Wait and then minute. immediately get rid of the power gear. Yeah. Then you still gain the acid effect on the shield effect. Yeah. Why do I feel like this may have possibly slipped through... I don't know, but I'm okay Play with testing. it. It also does seem like if you fire... Oh, oh no. Wait a minute. So you generate the acid barrier just by... just normally. Yeah. yeah. You need to power up with the power gear as well. Huh, okay. Like, so the way that it works is that you use power gear first, then use the barrier. Yeah. And you just do that at the beginning of every screen. Yeah, but it looks like you can use the barrier even if you're not charged up. Yeah, of course you can. Yeah, so what does power gear do? Power gear makes the... Ba so the barrier... Yeah. ...will kill things if it's in power gear. Like... Okay. Oh, I see. If you activate power gear and use the barrier... Yep. Um, the barrier will just kill things. Right. So you can just walk into stuff and they'll explode. Right. If you don't act to face using power gear, then it just blocks projectiles. Yes. I see. So basically, you never ever want to use this thing without activating power gear first. Because it's ludicrous. Seems sensible. Because you don't even have to have power gear on once you've activated it one time. What the... What the... How the... Oh. These guys. Okay, right. I don't right. like these guys. Uh, okay. Oh, I've seen these enemies before. They're like a new take on the uh, drill thingies from uh, Mega Man 10. Oh, God! Touché. Checkpoint, at least. You're on one health, the checkpoint. Can't be the checkpoint. I mean, I hope it was, but okay. Yeah, it was, look. Ah, huh, okay, no mini boss. That was surprisingly straightforward. Well, um, Acid Man didn't have um, a mini boss. Yeah, so didn't, Acid Man didn't have a had a checkpoint before a mini boss. Yeah, that's true. It might be a mini boss. There's been a mini boss in every stage, so I would imagine there is going to be one. Yeah.
really hazing these friggin' hand guys. Oh god ah! damn it! That's how you bullseye them. I probably shouldn't be using this so much, but I do know the boss isn't weak to it, so... I'm not quite sure what that... Um... Wait a minute, so who's this Tundra Man's weak to? Oh, what? Uh, Torch Man? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So Torch Man... Tundra Man's... Uh, sorry. Torch Man is weak to Tundra Man. Uh, Explosion Man... Blast Man is weak to Torch Man. And then we don't know any of the others. Because it seems like we can get through by completely fine in this game just using the Mega Buster. As it should be. I like the new speed gear upgrade that we've got. It's very good. It's, it's, it's going to be a bit disconcerting getting, getting used to this. Okay, so you know what this is like. Uh, using Flashman's power in uh, Quick Man Stage. That's what it's like. You're going to have to elaborate on that. Um, in Mega Man 2, yep. Quick Man has a section where laser beams come oh, across. Oh, yes, 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 right? yes, yes, yes. But if you use Flashman's power, you stop the laser beams. Because Flashman's power freezes time. Oh, right. So you can get through that super easy by Flash. Oh, look, he has a little digger. Ow. Power gear, possibly. There we go. Nice. That Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> oh, I thought that was going to be like an I want to be the guy thing. Or... Yeah, just what I was thinking. There we go. That's how you deal with it. You use the power gear. And Mega Man is basically on the fire at this point. Wow. There we go. One thing I'm really, really noticing in this is that, is that none of the weapons cost, um, in terms of, you know, the special ammo. Oh, God damn it! In terms of, spe in terms of special ammo, they're not, n none of them are costing that much to use. No, that's are true. They? In complete contrast to Mega Man 10, where some of the weapons you could use maybe once or twice. Yeah, and then you just lose all your yeah, ammo. Yeah, like, like, so like the Thunder Wall, for instance. Which is, yeah, I mean, well, a very, I mean, possibly makes it a bit, a bit t too easy, oh. because you know it's all right because we'll have lots and lots and lots of you know really really tricky jumps and endless bottomless pits to make up for that so lack of difficulty. But more importantly, it allows you to actually just try out the weapons and have fun. No, no, no. And I think the weapons no. and I think the weapons in this are actually they're good fun. They're inventive and they This is pretty funny, I'm not gonna lie. I'm having a good time with this. Yeah. Whereas in Mega Man 10, again Oh god damn it. Some of the weapons just seemed really uninspired. Ooh, that's such oh. tricky though. We need to be more careful. You know what actually really really help in this section? Oh you might want to get more ammo. Okay, don't worry about it. Dang Under it. That. What would really help in this section is that thing, um, which decreased knockback, hmm. but uh, never mind. I mean, like, it's, it, it seems to be encouraging you to use gears more for this, so I imagine speed gearing or something will freak out. Uh, I wish we hadn't got that power up. This is throwing me off. Good job. What the? Apple of that. <laughs> T solution. If I just stand near the middle and take the damage, it's probably going to be okay. I mean, you're not wrong. So. Bouncy ball seems to be really 
strong against just generic mooks. Yeah, it looks like Especially it. things that just stand in one place and shoot out stuff. Yeah, screw you. Yeah. Oh, this is the classic Mega Man trick. No, oh, that I was gonna say damage boost, but uh hmm. That yeah, didn't quite work. We're only on two lives. I also completely forgot that because you've got that thing, slowing down tight slowing down speed does not actually decrease our speed. In fact, you know what you've done? You've actually taken away Oh god damn it! You've taken away the main benefit of speed gear. No, I haven't. Yes, you have. Oh, well, we can uninstall it if you want. I, we, 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 we're friggin' better. Yeah, screw you. I think that's really handy. I like it a lot, but... Yeah, but the whole point about speed gear... Um, we've got full ammo on the... We've got near full ammo on that. Get the other ammo. The, the, the whole point about speed gear is it allows you to just slow down and just exactly position your jumps. Yeah, maybe you're right. I know I'm right. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. No. He's running out. He flashes when he runs no. out. No. No. Yeah, this seems no. like the best way to do it with this entire section. No. <laughs> Again. No. Running out. Whoa. Whoa indeed, Mega Man. Yeah, make sure you regenerate the ammo, by the way, because we're gonna need it. Bounce to death. Ah. How are you even meant to kill these guys apart from just spamming that? Um, I just mash and shoot them. It seems to work. Fine strategy. Uh, power gear and then uh, just know your way through. Oh, come on. Thank you. Boing. Boing. Okay. We're good, we're good, we're good, I think. Uh, nah, we're fine. We don't need that health. This is a... Nah. Oh, the thingies are coming. Oh, I, I love the thingies. They're great. Yeah, they're, you know, drill things. You can tell because they're swing shaking. Oh, I love them. They're so cool. Turn on speed gear, seriously. And then just jump up. Okay, or don't. Well, I can't jump high enough. Okay. But I think if one comes at you, you can use speed gear to gun it down. Uh, I don't think you... Oh, no, they're immune. Yeah, like. these... It's all right. I'm just standing here, being calm. I mean, damn it! Oh, I, yeah. Hmm. 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 Oh, we might be in trouble. Okay. So, firstly, we've got to get through no corridor. Fine. This is. I mean, yes, we kind of balls this up, guys, but uh, never mind. <laughs> At least, this, at least this part requires absolutely no effort on our part whatsoever. The fact that it reflects projectiles back at the enemy is the icing on the cake. Yeah, I know, the Power Gear version is really good. Well, to be precise, it doesn't actually reflect projectiles back, it's breaks them up into acid yes. bits. And fires back. Yeah, you wanna be using you wanna be using bouncy balls for this. Okay. Okay, hold on. No! I didn't want Whoa. to actually do that.
Okay, so the bouncy balls are definitely my favourite weapon in the game so far. Yeah. Yours I... definitely seems to be the acid barrier. I am a fan of acid barrier. Or, you know, <coughs> dual satellite 2. Dual satellite 2. The electric dual. Ooh! Smart, good, but, but no. I don't think you can actually... I don't know if they're coming in from predefined points or if they can come from any... Oh, god yeah. damn it. This is really tough. Speed gear? Oh, wait a minute. Okay, right. Okay. That's there the stuff. Go. Oh god damn it! Game, no! Remember, you have an E tank. I have lots of E tanks. Yeah. I will use them if I have to to stop us from getting over him. Speed gear, speed gear, speed gear! Bouncy balls, bouncy balls, bouncy balls! Yeah, I know, I know, I'm trying to deal with this. Um, Got him. Right. In balls we trust. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Nat. Nat. Okay, no. Fine. Fine, I'll play it safe. I mean, also, how many have we got? Six. We can't get any more. Exactly. Ooh! It's okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. Can we... Yeah, I'll uh, use the tank <laughs> That's suspicious. Okay. Yeah, I think there's something there, but I don't know. Oh, man. More of the guys! Okay, this I like. This is cool. That's really cool. Oh yeah, how do you like that? Okay. Do you reckon we've got the weakness? Uh Okay, so we We have these three that are unaccounted for at the moment. So I'll try throwing bouncy balls at it. I mean Bouncy balls, something like impact. I mean it It could work. Who knows? Oh heck. Impact man. No ho! He's an honourable sin, like... Okay, no. Okay, so no. Uh, acid. Oh, he does not like acid. Oh, boy. Okay. We're out of that. We go back to A the smart tactic. You use, it, you use the acid shield throughout the entire stage. It encourages you to use the acid throughout the entire stage. And now you don't have any to use on him for his weakness. Oh shoot! Oh my god, what? Oh, game!